Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we are at the Nidatul Barn and uh, we are driving the DBBR. I just dropped dead gorgeous looking train here and um, people are raving about this this line, this, um, this DLC. It's not made by Dovetail Games, it's another developer and um, They've just done an amazing job of it. People are raving, uh, the critics are raving about this uh, branch line. They say it's just so well done. The attention to detail, the finishing off all the uh, rail side, um, rail side um, objects, buildings, everything is just so sharp and so well done. There's no copy and paste or anything here. It is just a beautifully done uh, DLC and branch line. And um, today we are going to go from Stockholm to Heist Nida in the DBBR and uh, we're going to check out this route. We're going to do an express trip so there's no real stops. We depart here and we take our passengers all the way to Heist Nida in one big express trip. Um, so here is the map and this is where we are going to go. We're going to go all the way down. We've got one station to come through here. We're going to have to drop our speed as we divert around to that siding to come through the station. Uh, and then we come all the way down and finish off down here at um, Heist Night. So not a long trip. I think we're, um, we're cleared to travel around about 60 miles per hour most of the way apart from the places where we have to slow down. Um, so we're going to unlock the doors now and we're going to get our passengers all on board. Now I'm new to train simming so don't worry about it if I do everything wrong um, because I'm all it's all new to me okay put the reverser in forward we will turn our uh, turn our power on if we got our lights lights set to headlights yes um, and our key, we put our key in and we'll put that to output. Um, unlock doors. Okay, let's unlock our doors. Get our doors unlocked so we can get some passengers on board. Load the passengers and then we're going to have a go. I'm going to have a go. Um, this is only my second video on this train. I did the introduction to the Nidatul Barn. Uh, is it the Nidatul Barn? On my last video. So um, this is my first actual time I've driven this train. Uh, apart from just a, a bit of a practice in the um, in the training uh, training tutorial. Uh, but yeah, beautiful day. No clouds in the sky. So. Uh, it's an express line, so there's not many stops we can cruise. Well, there's no stops. We cruise right through to our destination. Lock doors. Okay, it's time to get going, guys. So we will lock our doors. That's good. Now I'll turn off my ugly dial so we can see everything on the screen a little bit better. Um, our brake is right off. I think we are good. Give ourselves a little bit of juice and we should start moving. And here we go. is off completely. Okay, our speed here is about 40 miles an hour by the look of it. So I'm going to try, I'm going to try not to overspeed. Try not to overspeed and be a good boy on this truck. Uh, already getting up to our maximum speed here, I'm going to be careful. And away we go.
Right, so we are good. We are good to clear all the way to 60 miles an hour. The scenery is beautiful. You've got to admit, a lot of crops and farms. Just a single line uh, trip, very scenic, but a little bit like the Somerset. A little bit like the Somerset line, really. Just a single line, very, very scenic. Well, let's try not to go over speed here. We are going downhill, so we are tending to uh, speed up quite quickly. Scenery and the track sides, uh, villages and buildings really are quite stunning. It really is just a beautiful, a beautiful train set. This one, uh, I can see myself, uh, I can see myself doing services along this line quite regular. I think. Look at this, just amazing, all this farmland and crops and just bring my speed down a little bit. Be careful of my speed, try and stay uh, under the speed limit. miles an hour is all we're allowed to do. Let's check our map. Oh yeah, we're coming down quite quickly. Quite quickly. Is that sugar beets there? Sugar beets? The crop? Oh, it looks like corn, doesn't it? like corn or maize but um, usually maize or corn is growing a lot more dense than that so maybe it is sugar beet don't know really but just beautiful scenery eh? I love the look of this train, the real sort of Art Deco, it's not really Art Deco, it's too new to be Art Deco, but just got that old look about it, the shape and the colours there, the mint green and turquoise, <laughs> really is quite nice. Nice colours inside, a little bit of wear, you can see marks and stains and scratches, so it doesn't look like a brand new train. Looks well used and worn and faded and marked at the top there on the on the lining of the cab really quite nice coming through another village here okay let's check our map Mm, coming down quite quickly, almost halfway already. Uh, now this, we are in custom route mode today. I set up this route myself as a custom little custom uh, service uh, from Stockholm to Heist Nida. So we should do a few more of these. 
and uh, I've saved them in my memory and I want to do some more trips more often. I want to do the full length of the line but it does take quite a while it's, to go from one end to the other. It's quite a, be quite a long video. Uh, but maybe I can do a live stream. Uh, maybe the next one I do will be a live stream. And um, we'll have a look, at, we'll stop off at all the little villages and have a bit of a look around. Maybe for some collectibles and things like that. Let me know in the comments what you would like to see and on the stream you can chat and ask me questions. And if you'd like to have a closer look at something you can just uh, tell me and I can stop and have a close look at something for you and have a bit of a look around. So uh, maybe do that, keep an eye out and I will announce when I'm going to do my live stream. Okay, now this one coming up here, we've got to start slowing down a little bit. Because we've got this little station coming up here where we need to... Um, we need to divert around that little siding, that loop. Uh, so we don't want to go over speed there. Here, there will be a speed restriction. I think it will come down to something like 30, um, just up here at this little station platform. We're not going to stop here because we are an express service. We're going right through to uh, Heist Nida. Here we go. Here. Uh, we got to come down to 40. Down to 40. So I think we've managed that okay. We got down to 40 just in time, I think. Just in time. Right, I think we can go back up to, uh, I think we can go back up to 60 soon. Yep, back up to 60 now. Very, very impressed with the the, um, the rail side scenery, the blossom trees, the farms, the crops growing, even the um, the grass and the fields, the farm buildings. Everything so well done. A real attention to detail, and uh, I think all the critics and the the armchair critics and all the People who have reviewed this are absolutely right. It is probably one of the most beautiful and well done um, branch lines and DLCs ever put out for uh, Trains and World, I would say. It is one of the best, if not the best. Look at the, the blossom trees over there. Beautiful. Right, let's have a look at our map. We're coming up to our destination here already. Not far to go, not far to go at all. We'll be arriving in uh, Heitschneider. And that will be at the end of our express service today. 
that is our destination platform. NIDA platform didn't take us long at all, does it? Especially not travelling at 60 miles an hour. And um, we'll do the next stage. I think we'll do another express service uh, on my next video. And we'll do another little short trip until we get all the way down to the end of the line, maybe. I think that'll be quite cool. Here we go unlock the doors and we are done and it will come up with the uh, it'll come up with the screen for us to uh, give us a bit of a ranking and a, tell us how well we did and tell us all about our faults and what we did wrong uh, let's have another quick look around there's no real station here is there it's just a platform basically um, there we are Heich Schneider there on the sign quite a few people here a little village beautiful but um, just a platform no real sort of train station to speak of beautifully modeled let's have a look around here just lovely so atmospheric it really is immersive and atmospheric um, when developers go to this much trouble and make everything so nice just flawless really Okay, well that's about it guys. I will unlock the doors and that'll be it I think. Load the passengers. Loading the passengers, they may ask me to lock the doors as well before it finishes. Before we finish the mission, they may ask me to uh, lock the doors, and then that'll be it for the for the service. Okay, lock the doors. Here we go. Let's lock the doors. And that's it for the service, guys. That is it. Oh, I did go over the speed limit a few times. Look at that. One, two, three. I did slow down for that uh, that little bypass loop at that station, but just a little bit too fast as I came into it. I thought I might have done. Thought I might have done. And then a little bit fast there. So we'll have to work on those skills uh, because I would like to keep it at the right speed on this service. Um, as we advance through all the missions and through all the services it's going to be a lot of fun and I'm going to really enjoy this we could even put some other trains on this branch line we could go into off the rails mode and I could put my 323 uh, my class 323 on here that would be a nice service as well because that's a beautiful train and uh, we might do that as well mix it up a little bit have a little bit of fun <laughs> Okay guys, keep watching because I'm going to do some streams on this channel and that'll be good. You can chat, ask me questions, ask me to stop at the station and have a look around for stuff uh, and you can interact and have a bit of fun that way and uh, it'd be really nice to have your company. Okay, hi to all the new subscribers. Thank you for stopping in and um, thank you for your likes and I'll see you again soon on the next video. Enjoy your train simulator. Over and out.